Okay, I'm going to show you that I have an iPhone with everything except picture messaging on Metro. Now it says Metro PCS only because I use this app from Cydia called Fake Carrier. And I was able to put Metro PCS. Now, as most of you know, when you uh, do a Star 22804 um, and you update the PRL for Metro to have like a little zero type of thing, mine says 3G. Now, you're probably wondering, how does this his say 3G? Well, he probably changed it. No, I didn't. And I will show you. Let's run a speed test. I'll do a quick speed test for you right here. Let's see. 1,356 kilobits per second. Now, moment of truth, is it really on Metro or is it just jerking our chain? Well, start 228. Let's see what it has. Let's see what happens. Metro PCS. Hello. 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 Now, how did I do this? Well, it took me a little while to figure out, but um, pretty much on XDA, this guy has a nice little post and he's got a website. Now the website is metroprl.blogspot.com and here you'll get this ad fly thing which is so ridiculously annoying. If you wait like five seconds, it will go away. I know, it's annoying, trust me. But anyways, uh, I used 3026. I usually use 3027, but for some reason it didn't work, so I used 3026. Click there, download from Media Fire. Now, I did follow a post on iPhone developers. Let me see if I can get this back up. iPhone developers. Let me get the post back. Sorry if my iPhone's being a little blurry, but this one that I'm using to record is... Uh, I have it on straight talk, not Metro. Thing is, iPhone jailbreaking and modding. And, and Force Rome. Here we go. Now this post here, you know, it it's it's a very good post. You read it. It's by uh, Besom. This guy right here on iPhone for iPhone developers. The only problem, it, the reason it didn't work for me is because this is the right. You know, this is the right steps, except don't use this PRL that they have here. Go to Metro PCS or Metro PRL .blogspot .com, whatever it was that I showed you. Download 3026. Now, it's it, it wouldn't work for me because I didn't have Tether Me APNs installed. You have to download uh, a repo onto Cydia. And let me see what the repo is so you don't pay for it, obviously. For iFile or uh, Tether Me APNs. Let me see what the repo was called. Sources. Uh, okay, the repo is http colon four slash four slash repo dot insanely i dot com. Insanely is i n s a n e l y i dot com four slash. Add that. I'll say some legacy blah blah blah. I said add anyways. Then um, for me, for some reason, when I would try to download iFile or Tether Me APNs, I would get a hash some check error. So I had to reboot the phone. And mine, the one I flashed here is tethered, so I had to you know use Red Snow to boot it back tethered. Then everything worked. I installed iFile and I installed Tether Me APNs. Tether Me APNs is the one I installed, the free versions, obviously, because you know they're no older or whatever you call it. But anyways, um, then most of you probably wait. How did you get the internet to work? Well. I have a program called DFS. Let's see. Do, 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 do. I have a program called DFS. It's um, you have to go to cdmatool.com. See the top of cdmatool.com. And I had to pay hundred dollars to flash it. It's a credit. And um, I'm not advertising for them. This is not an advertisement. I'm just saying that's what I use. So yeah. Um, and anyways, you follow their directions on how to connect to it. But the problem with them is that they don't. You can't write a PRL with their web, with their servers, or with their program. It doesn't allow any PRLs over a thousand bytes. Now I've never found one PRL that was over, that was under a thousand bytes. So um, I had to manually insert the PRL, which you know, 
which eventually worked. Let me see if I can show you the repo real quick. Hold on, let me see if I can focus this damn camera. There we go. That's the repo on sanlyirepo.com. And let me show you. Sorry that I'm like blacking everything out. I use, let me show you, Fake Carrier is that one, but that one you just get from the regular studio. Uh, where's the other one? iFile, iSystem, which I got from Insanely i, and then Tether Me APNs. Well, you have to install OpenSSH to use uh, DFS, by the way. But, you know, that's if you choose to do that. I did Tether Me APN Editing. Not Tether Me, I don't know why that's on there. Maybe installed by itself, but Tether Me APN editing is what I used. Now I've tried changing around the settings to try to get picture messaging to work, but I couldn't. Sorry, not too good at recording, huh? Um, this is one of the settings I have on here. Picture messaging is still not working. I know for Cricket they have a a carry or uh, IPCC that I think either ammo or somebody one of those guys in the forums uh, made but uh, yeah man my iPhone just unfocuses but yeah that's, that's how I got the iPhone get 3G on Metro PCS oh FYI I am in uh, Miami so my 3G coverage let me show you is all of pretty much Florida so I'm sorry for you guys who don't have 3G I know you're probably seeing this video probably, you suck so much and again Adfly it's probably got you know you stuck so much gonads. Sorry, I hate to rub it in, but uh, yeah. See, here in Florida we got 3G everywhere, except maybe like where Tallahassee, where T-Pain is from. But screw T-Pain, probably got AT&T. All right, guys. Well, that's how I got 3G on this uh, phone here, uh, Metro PCS. And again, we're blurry. Well, thanks for watching. Ask me anything you like, and if I don't respond, yeah, it's because I haven't looked at it. So yeah, thanks.